All right, guys, setting up right now. Got a little blubberm right here. Chunky sucker. Um, yeah, first time at this spot. It looks really good. Very optimistic. Just gonna thread this blubberm right here. Just picked it up from Higby's. Real juicy guy. Thread him up a few times. Looking pretty damn good, so. There we go. First, first rod rigged up. Send this out there. Just completely bomb it. I'm not sure where these fish are. Like I said, my first time fishing Delaware Bay. Um, just gonna be pretty optimistic. Just throw it out there and we'll see what happens. Finally got away from the crowds. I guess it's all right. Not as deep as I wanted it to be, but I guess it's all right, so. Bring this back to the rod holder. We'll fish here for a little bit if we don't get anything. Might have to switch spots, but right now we'll just get set up here. Give it maybe an hour or two. Hopefully get at least one bite. And uh, yeah, maybe catch some big stripers, maybe some big perch, never know. Rod's loose, hopefully a big 42 incher comes and steals that worm. So we're set up right now. Let's hope the fish are hungry. Dope. Let's go set up a few other rods. Dad's hooking them up now. I got four rods in total, all hooked up with blood worm. Maybe toss a clam, bunker out later, and uh, see what we can do. All right, fourth rod going out. I'm balling, usually like Kobe. What happened, you said? Saw a bite? You got a fish? Hey, white perch, first one of the day, guys. Look at that. That's a solid perch, dude. Uh, let me see if we'll keep him. Felt it hit? Dude, nice fish. Let's keep this one, yeah. Look at that, guys. My dad got the first purse today right there. Stoked. We need some more worm on here. Get some more blood worms. Uh, we'll keep this guy. First, first fish today, we'll keep him. We'll see. He just has a benchmark for the size of the fish for today. This fishery is probably very healthy. It'll be all right with us taking a small fish. I mean, there's no one out here fishing a small isolated creek. We'll be fine out here. Have some good perch tonight, sick. What is up guys, welcome back to our video. Today, March 29th, 2020. Here, you can see, basically the middle of nowhere. Um, fishing a small desolate beach on the Delaware Bay. Found a little creek back there on Google Maps. Decided to fish this cove behind me. Oh, there's a fight, there's a fish. Fish guys, as I was recording my intro. Fish. Took a while to get him out. Let's see, we lost him. Dang it. As I was saying, guys, basically in the middle of nowhere right now. I had a bite before I was, before I ran over here. I had a bite on that rod. Probably a perch, but that's my striper rod. His hooks are way too big to really catch a perch on there. But um, yeah, we're here basically in the middle of nowhere. This one, blood worms. Got four rods out, two looking for big stripers, um, and then two dedicated to mostly perch. So we'll see what happens fishing this little cove right here. Took like an hour and a half drive. Pretty nice spot. Um, got some nice juicy blood worms. It's cloudy, rainy as you can see. So perfect fishing weather right now, no wind. So feeling pretty optimistic about this. Uh, obviously open to catch some perch, brought the cooler. Hopefully looking to fill the cooler today, which was uh, sponsored by Harry C. Whitmire. He dropped me off, my uncle. So check out his plumbing company if you guys need any plumbing uh, assistance during this quarantine or whatever, they're still open. 
So if you have any issues, just give him a call. And thanks, shout out to him for the cooler. So thanks a lot. And uh, yeah, guys, look at fill it up with perch. Catch some stripers, obviously release them. And uh, yeah, hopefully get a haircut sooner or later. Gonna start looking like uh, a bush soon. So hopefully looking to catch some fish, guys. I gotta stop talking, keep rambling on. So see you guys on the GoPro. Should be a great day. Fishing the incoming tide right now. Looking forward to some solid fishing. Peace. Black line over here. Could be a sign of a fish. Actually, we definitely had a bite. That's for sure. I have a fish on, guys. Don't know why this one keeps getting all the hits. There's a rod right next to it. It's not doing too well. I'll see it happen. Definitely had a bite over here. These are, I set these rods out for stripers with the big hunks of bloodworm, but it's looking like mostly perch are just hitting them. Stealing my freaking bait. Oh my god, we got a freaking perch. No way. Look at that. That is funny. Chunky perch. Second bite on the white rod. Did not know he was on there. Took my blood worms to rob me, so I'll probably put smaller pieces on here. Trying to catch big fish, but it's not looking like it's gonna happen with all these little guys around, so it's not even a big perch, little dinker. Send him back. Oops, sorry bud. Just sitting there on the circle hook. Didn't just set the hook or anything. Cause the circle hook just hooks right in their mouth. So I'm gonna go bait this guy back up. Then we'll toss him back out. First fish for me today, second perch of the day. My dad got one perch, I got a perch. Everyone's winning today. So this is the size of the worm. Real nice size worm, probably 12 inches right there. Foot long worm, so not bad at all. I'm just gonna cut this guy up probably into fourths because I don't want to look. I mean, that's a sizable worm right there. Also, shout out to shout out to H uh, C W Plumbing Whitmire for the cooler. Definitely putting it to work today. Hopefully, gonna fill it with some more perch, but doing good so far. Cut this guy into fourths or thirds. Let's hook these up. There we go. All right. I'll bait it up real quick. Oh, worm just flew off, dang it. Oh well, gotta cast that softer, I guess. There's a bite, look at that guys. Perch right there for sure. Got him on, yes. Feels good. Oh, that's a solid freaking perch, dude. Oh, did he come off? That's a solid perch, bro. Solid perch right there. It's a good fish, dude. I don't know if it's a perch, it might be a striper. A big perch, a striper for sure. Little bass, yeah, knew it. Baby bass, dude, first one of the day. Tiny, tiny bass. Knew it, by the way, he was fighting. Boy, he's definitely heating up on this incoming tide right now, guys. Nothing big like I wanted, but hey, you know what? I'll take some baby bass and some solid perch. All right, there we go, guys. First bass of the day. A little rat, not what I was looking for. But you know what? Anything's anything's better than nothing. So, chunky little bass right there, sending them off for another day. You good, bud? There you go. Spit up my blood worm and head on out. Dope. There's fish. That's a perch, baby. He's on, he's on. Oh, it was on. Dang it, did I lose him? Oh, I might have lost him, guys. Frick. That was a solid perch. Pretty sure I lost him. Dang it. And I still on, I think. I honestly got no clue. <laughs> we'll see in a second. That was a good fish, dude. Oh, he's on, he's on. Feels like a good perch, dude. 
We'll see, we'll see. Oh, it's a striper. Again. Bigger than the last one, but not a striper. All right, guys, here we go. First bass of the day. Well, second bass of the day, actually, sorry. Tiny little rat right there, he had a blood worm. Um, GoPro just died, so gonna go release him. Just right there, and yeah. Inhaled that blood worm, thought he was a big perch. Let's send him back. Oh, 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 dude, dude, dude. That's a striper, 100%. <laughs> there you go. Nice one, dude. Just hook that. Hey, maybe it's a big perch, you don't know. We got two of them. Yeah, I've doubled up, dude. You got a perch and a striper, guys. Look at that. I'll snag the little striper in the tail. Here, let me get that for you. Oh, let me get this. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Sweet. Snagged the freaking striper in the tail on the way in. Just shows how thick they are out there. Got them out. Crazy. Oh, yeah, pricking good. See you, dude. There we go. A striper, I mean, a decent perch right there. That's enough for a meal. Yeah, keep that guy tossing in the cooler. There you go. Yeah. Look at that perch, guys. I nice show death. Toss him in the cooler. I'll cast this rod back out. Uh, you worm or no? uh yeah. I might as well bring one back. There we go, dude. First double up of the day. Sick. Lots of baby stripers out there, guys. Tons of them. But it's not our target for today. We're hoping for some bigger stripers. But you know what? We'll take these baby guys. And the perch, you never know what else show up out here. There's fish, dude. There you go. Ah. Oh. Jumbo perch, dude. Jumbo. Oh my god. Look at the size of that perch, guys. Holy frick. Dope, dude, dope. That's a huge fish. All right, All right here. Him. Switch, I'll, I'll take him. Take him, I'll cast him right back up. Look at that perch, guys. I'm gonna toss him in the cooler real quick. My dad just caught that slaunch. That's probably a pound, pound and a half right there. Giant, giant fish. Let's go toss him in the cooler. That is a tank. Toss him in the cooler. There he goes, sick. Birds fly high in Dubai. Oh, there's a fish. <laughs> fish on. The 11 footer. Came, brought this guy for 40 inch stripers, but we're catching. Mini perch. Definitely a fish on here. Let's see what it is. Hopefully it's a big perch, but we'll see. Yep, big perch. Ah, decent perch. Dinner perch at least. Perch number four for dinner. Inhaled that blood worm, didn't lose him. Awesome. Decent perch. He'll make good dinner, but not as big as the one I got, my dad got. And he's got one over there too. Sick. All right, I toss him in the cooler in a second. Fish on down there too. Cast this out real quick. I'll go check out his big perch over there. Oh yeah, that's a tank. Big old perch right there, guys. Circle rigs are working well. There's mine compared to my dad's. 
sizable perch right there. Take them. Amen. There they are. Look at that. All right, let's go toss them in the cooler. Had to move spots, couldn't fish over there anymore because of the tide just ran up real quick. So, switch over this little beach right here. Moved a few feet and the bite still remains hot. So, there we go. Toss them in there. Nope. Let's catch some more, baby. Woo! That's a solid hit, man. He's there. Got him. Perch. Thought it was a striper, but it's a nice perch. Doesn't feel that big, but actually it's probably the smallest one of the day. This guy feels tiny. Baby perch, man. Baby, baby, baby. Oh, you know what? It's actually not that small. He's fat. Fat, but he's he's tiny. I'll let you go, little bud. Perch guys, hit hit pretty hard. Thought he was a striper, but uh, just a little baby perch. Send him back out. Uh, I'm probably putting a new, new bubble on here. Dude, I don't know if I got a fish or what, but this is big. I don't think it's a fish, guys. It's not really moving, probably a bunch of grass. If it is a big fish, that'll be sick. Oh, it's a horseshoe crab. It's a horseshoe crab, I think. What is this thing? Oh my God. Caught a friggin' horseshoe crab, guys. Not expecting that. Um, let me get my pliers, get this guy out. <laughs> there we go. Got him out, guys. Catch and release horseshoe crab. Thought it was a big striper, but there he goes. See you, bud. A few moments later. All right, guys. Just got done cleaning up the fish. Um, yeah, cut up all the perch. Kept around, I think, six or seven. But um, yeah, cut the perch up, laid them nicely. We'll cook them tomorrow night for dinner. Um, just got back about an hour and a half ago. Um, we're out there, pretty long portion of the day. We left here around 8, 8.30ish. Got down there around nine. Started fishing around 9.45, almost 10 o'clock-ish. So. Yeah, it's a long day of fishing. Um, had a ton of fun catching baby stripers and actually some pretty nice sized perch. So definitely be going back down there. Not sure how long. I know the stripers run again down there in June. Might have been a little too late um, for the early spring run, but the late spring run, they should definitely be down there in June. So uh, yeah, solid trip. Had a ton of fun. Um, used a good amount of bloodworms. We're probably making our trip tomorrow using the leftover bloodworms that I have looking for some bigger stripers on the Delaware but that, that's another video so yeah cut up the perch um just again shout out to Whitmire Plumbing for the Yeti Roadie Cooler um yeah generous donation so if you guys have any plumbing needs heating cooling check them out I'll put a link in the description um to their website and Facebook so thanks again huge shout out to uh Andrew Schmidt for the donation Thank you. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. Road to 1,000 subscribers is close. We're at like 870 now. So if you could, like like and subscribe. Don't really ask that a lot. But uh, yeah, had a great day today. Pretty good video, I think. So um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out. See you in the next one.